in the office of the Human Rights Defenders and Access to Justice Advocacy Center. Our claim is a solution that's streaming from a cage Allen Avenue branch. In the case of children neglect and abandonment reported by Ms. Uchena Odaba against Ms. Okichuko Odaba, please join us as we interview there for a peaceful resolution. For your further information, you can visit our website on www.hldac.org. Thank you. Okay, madam, let's hear from you. What is the issue? Okay. The issue is that me and my husband were living in Ghana. In Ghana? Yes, ma'am. Can you speak up? Okay, me and my husband were living in Ghana. So, let's have a heart of problem in his business. So along the line, he decides to travel out of the country. So when he travels out of the country, before you know it, people, people begin to give him rumors that I'm having a stromalitar affair, that all the goods he has been sent him for me, I'm using the money to come build a house in my father's place. And also that I went and make charm so that my husband will not prosper while he's in China. As in, so that he will come back empty handed. Why is uh, he will come back from China empty handed? According to him, he said that these are the three things that he will use and judge him anytime he comes back to Nigeria or to Ghana. So immediately he said that, and I was like, You should tell me the person that tell you this, uh, this thing so that me and the person can sort it out. He refused. So, and since he said it, he has stopped taking care of me and the children. Though he's paying for their school fees, but in terms of feeding, he has not been bringing his weight. He has not been bringing one man. So I was like, not you are not giving us any money. He was like, we are doing business. But later, we had business in our, we had problem in our business area, which the Ghanaians people asked us to leave the market. As in the Nigerians that to leave the market, they lock up all, all, all the shops in Ghana. So I was stranded. So the little goods I brought out, I gave it to my sister. We have a place that we are managing. We keep our show glass, we are managing there. But later they were like, when you pay them, they will open your shop for you. So let's I have to go and pay. When I pay them, they come and open my shop. So when they opened the shop, I arranged my goods. They were like, if I'm to open the shop, I should look for a Ghanaian that will manage the shop. So I have to get a Ghana that will manage the shop, but they were like, I should remove everything here so that when the Ghana is coming, we know that it's a new place. So I have to remove all the goods there. So when I remove all the goods there, after the next day, there was a heavy rainfall. Sorry. Hello, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Hello, sir. Hello. Continue. Let them listen to you. Okay. Hello, sir. There was a heavy rainfall that entered the flood entered almost everybody in the in, uh, in our working place. The flood entered their shops and spoiled all of, all, all all the goods there. So I told my husband, he didn't mind me. So I was like, how are we, how are we going to cope? Where are we going to start from? He didn't mind me. He's not sending anything because they're giving him lies that I'm um, that I'm I'm having a traumatic affair and also I went to a prepare sham, sham so that he can come back empty handed and some other things too. So I was just hustling on my own, taking care of my children. I'll go to the market, people will give me goods. I have to go inside the village and supply the goods. So I was hustling like that, though he has been paying the school fees. And I have been hustling like that, waiting for the day he will come back. So the day came, there was a day that I learned that my husband has come back. He didn't tell me that he has come back from China. So I learned that he has come back. Although through all this while my brothers they have been calling him, so they will set him. But he didn't mind my brother. So when he come back, my brother heard about it. So my brother called him and said he should come. So they will talk about the issue. They refused to come. So we were like, we should go to the village. Since he has come back, let's inform the elders. So since he has come, uh, come back, let him come, let my people to, to, to come. So we talk about the issue. So when my people come, my people was like, if I'm still interested in the marriage so that they will make peace. I said, yes, I'm still interested. So they said that whatever my husband said about me, we are going to beg him. We are not going to bet him or begin to talk, 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 talk. I said, no problem. 
So we, we are my brothers, uh, my brothers, they came to my village, as in my husband's village. So when they came, they were like, they begin to ask my brother, my husband, what is the problem? So he began to talk. So my brother didn't tell him anything until that day he was getting back. The, somebody that is like a father to him, the man was like, you should start going home. As my brothers, they should start going home because our village and my place is far from his own place. That my brother, they should start going home. That him, the father, will settle the case. So my brothers, they left. Being the next day for them to settle the case. So the man come. No, the next day, the man come for them to settle the case. Before the man come, my husband has been preparing to leave. No, in the evening time, they were like, I should have beg the elder sisters. That when I beg the elder sister, my husband doesn't have any problem. So I have to kneel down, beg all the women in the house. When I beg them, they say they... What are you begging them for? That you slept around? That you sleep around? No, I'm begging them for them to talk to my husband so that he will accept me. Because they were like, anything they tell my husband, my husband, if they tell my husband the case is okay, my husband will believe. So I begged them, they said, okay, they've heard me. Then the next morning, all of them just packed their teeth and left, and left to Lagos. So in the afternoon time, my husband too, he was preparing, bathing the children. So my first son, I come and tell me that, uh, mommy, daddy said that he's, he's taking us out. That was on the Valentine's Day this year. Say my husband is taking us out. So I was like, maybe he wants, wants to take the children out. So my son was like, no, that from the place we go, from there, daddy said from there, we're not going back to Lagos. I said, eh, and he didn't tell me anything. So I have to go and take my children. I carry my children and I was, let me go and keep one. And I take him out of the house. So when he saw me, he was like, where is the child? I told him I kept the child. He said I should not bring the child. So him, he said, he went there and carried the child. So I was dragging the child with him and the other one too. So his people, his brothers and his mother, they were like, I should leave the, the children. If I want to go, I should go. I should leave the children. They want to take my children from me. So I begin to cry. So the villagers now come. They were like, what have I done? And they're believing all of, all of, even my husband too, they beat me. Even the older brother. So the villagers, the youth that began to beat them back, back. They were like, what have I done to them? Why are they Shit treating me like this? Why are they treating me like this? If there is any issue, we should go inside and talk about it. Or if my husband doesn't want the marriage again, he should plan on how to take care of the children, not that he will come and take the children from me. So when the man that is in charge of our marriage, the man that guaranteed the marriage, I don't know, the man has to come. The man heard when I was shouting, crying, so he said he leave his house, he has to come. When he come, he asked us the problem, he narrated. So he was like, since this is what my husband said, and I want to make peace. He was like, since uh, children are involved, there is no need of separation, that they have to make peace. So they were like, the next day or in the night, they will come and, and settle the case between me and my husband. I said, okay. Before that next day, my husband now carried his bag. He said he's traveling back to Lagos, only him. So I was like, no, you shouldn't travel. You have to wait. The others are coming. So we talk. He said he's traveling. He, he's coming back in a big sign. So I said, no. All this while you have been telling me things on phone. Now that you've come back, let's sit down and talk about the things you told me. He said, no, that he's going. So I have to drag him. We ran through the villages before they now follow backyard, jump the fence, and from there he left. So when he's going, he never dropped one naira for us. So we were waiting. Right to sneak. So we were waiting. So we were waiting for him. He never dropped any one naira for us. And they also the mother has to she pack all the food and keep in her room. Anytime she's going, she will lock the door. She doesn't give us food. My children, like the elder one, he was like, well, once I bath them finish, they will go. When they go, they will be playing. After play, when they go, they will be playing. Maybe the people cook food. They will just give my children food. That is how my children has been eating. And I will call my husband. He said that I have money. That he's not sending anyone there for me. That I have money. Do you really build house in your village? I did not build any house. I've asked him to go and check. Just make investigation. Go to my village. Send your people. I did not build any house in my village. Summarize so that they can talk. Summarize because I need to talk to other people. Okay. 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 So that is how my children has been feeding. And I will call him. He said he doesn't have money. The last one was that he, my child was hung hungry. 
I ran one o'clock. They haven't eaten anything. So I have to, he was crying. So I have to call the father. So when I called the father, the father was like, what do you want to eat? The child said, you want to eat rice. Then I was expecting the father to tell me, okay, then tell mama to give you people rice or take money from you or I will send money for you so you people can eat. He didn't do it. So when I didn't hear from him, I have to go to the village, somebody, and beg the person to give me indomie that will call my husband. My husband will send the money for you. The person agreed, give me indomie on credit. I have to come prepare for the children. And the children eat. When they were eating, my mother-in-law brought some indomie and gave to one of them. I don't need all those pages too. Go straight to the point. I'm not interested in all those things. Okay. Like some of you don't know how to compose your talk. So it's indomie story now that I'll sit down while I need to attend to other people. How your mother-in-law bring indomie? Who brought rice? Who brought to Google? I don't need. Compose yourself. Give me a few points on that one. Let let me intervene. I'm going to do that. Okay. This after three. Okay. Now we have been in the village for long, and he's not caring. Have no feeding fee. No, I called him that the children will start school. He didn't mind me. I called him again. All the children in the school in the village have started school. My children are crying. When I ask them, you say, "Mommy, I want to go to school." I will call the father. What are we? Tell me. Let me know my stand. He will not mind me. It was like if I can't if I can't take the care of the children, I should give him the children. So he How old are the One is twelve years, one is seven years. It was like she give him the children. So when I didn't hear from him, I said I can't give my children for you. So when I didn't hear from him, it was like I, I should send the children back to the mother. Then if I want to which to mother? To his own mother. I should send the children back to his mother. So the mother will take care of them. Then any place I want to go, I should go. So when I didn't hear from him, I was like, okay, my children, they should stay here. Let me go back to Ghana and call, so I'll come and take them back. So when I get to Ghana, I have to call him again. What are you saying? So the children will start school before they call. So when I didn't hear from him, I have to register my son in a, a school. So when I registered him in a school, he now brought some police to my place. It was like in Ghana, I, being Nigeria. in Nigeria. So then, then come and do the police I, I, from which state? From which from, police station? From East. From Anambara State, uh -huh. he took the police and then arrested my elder brother. He was like that. I carried the children and ran away. That I don't want him to see the children. So my brother has told me that. Is he living in Anambra or is he living in Lagos? He's living in Lagos, but from Lagos he traveled to Anambra. Okay. So but he, where is he living? He's living in Lagos now. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. So my brother said I should come when I come so that we can settle the issue. So when I, 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 I have to take my bus and come to Lagos. When I come, I was like, if you send me money, so I can come, I can bring the children to East. He was like, he sent it. Uh, he was like, it's like, he, he sent was like, it's like, he was like, what is the end now? Just tell okay, me, the what end, is this? The end now is that he said he needs the children. So I told him that I can't give him the children. And also, I want him to be taking care of my children. Although I've registered my child in a school, so I want him to be paying their school fees. Our house rent has expired in Ghana, which I don't have the money. And also, so you I'm, live in Lagos and you live in Ghana, or you divide yourself in Ghana and Nigeria. I'm living in Ghana. And you enroll the children in Nigeria. I tell myself, I tell the children to stay with my sister. No, the children will remain with only one parent. I have either the children stay them. with you or they stay with their father. The children, my, my first son is in body school. So what I want him to do here is for him to help me to pay the children's school fees and our children. You have you move on with your life. I didn't, I'll be begging him, I don't know his whereabouts, and I'll be like, asking him where he is. He that means you have moved on now. He himself, he has moved on. I don't know where he's Have you returned the diary or there was no diary? No, there is no And both of you, where are you from? In Nigeria, where? Anambra State. Both of you, yes. from Anambra State. You move on, you move on. No returning of diary. Maybe both of you remarry again in heaven when you die from this age. No, I've not moved on. He himself, he has moved on. Okay, explain yourself. Let's see what is the issue. Yeah, the problem is that I live in, live in Ghana for a long time. I live in Ghana for more than 15 years now. So God bless me with money. If it's money, I have money. I marry my wife the way that I marry, the way everything is supposed to be. So I have an issue of money. I have a problem with my business. In my business. I'm not traveling to China. I use more than 50, 50 million. Some of them is my money, some of them is bank money. So after I left, for me to miss to China, from that place, I've been sending news to my wife. Some of my friends in Alaba, some of them send news of the air consulting living there. My friend in, in, in Ghana, go to China, send news. The, 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 the bank people are calling money. I owe them almost five million. 
a letter say the letter said that I'm, I'm a good person. They give my wife five million naira here, ten thousand dollars to start up the business again. Letter in Ghana. Yes. So if they did like that, it's no small. My wife, if my wife, sometimes if I call my wife, for me to see my wife, for me to see my son, my wife will never show me my wife. Or video. You can never show me my son. Okay. Sometimes I'll call my wife for only tonight. Where are you? He said, I'm in the church. Who are you praying for? Am I not going to marry you? What are you praying for? It's not for success and life. God has given us everything. Why? One day you will not be at, one day you will be in the church. Who is saying you go to church? One day they will be in the church. Why is it? You will not be in the church. Later, I have four shops. My wife created first one, almost one for certain million to the business. Another one, he rented 350,000, he put into the business. I sell some of my piece of land, I put inside the business. I also in China, I put inside the business. The one that makes me cry is that my wife, upon all the goods I'm sending, my wife rented my shop without, or without my consent. So rented your shop out? Rented the, yes, above, rented the three shop. Come on, rented the, the one that, the main one, one and city. He rented it out. The shop had rented some person, 5 million naira. He rented it to rent from 900,000 naira. I asked her why. I do not hear. You see, the police station, they told me that my wife had rented the shop out. From that person, I'm not begging them to help to release my wife so that I can pay the money. And let her so, so bring the Who money. arrested her? The people that he rented the room because he was supposed to rent that shop out because it's myself. My they friend, should he check the existence. They should check the um, so after that one, after you rented the shop out, you take all the goods inside the shop and go and pack somewhere. I don't know what, what kind of goods. Battery, charger, earpiece, and everything. You are into a battery, phone, and phone accessories. You keep it somewhere. Later, for some days, run form and store all the goods of more than 50 to 20 million. The people that bring goods from China, they go and summon me. I start paying them. Every month, every month, they said I'm going to pay them 300,000. 2020, I paid them almost 2.8 million at the finish. Another one in Ghana come, the one they give us, the one they give us a work for something, I've not paid that one finish. Okay, my wife, where do oh, they give her goods? Yes, no. And she did not return. No, they turned the money. And you are not paying the debt. You are not paying the debt. Okay, my wife, where they, if, if all these goods is not good, I'm more. I send you goods of how many million? This first bring with this goods here. How much do you sell? And give me back so that I can be eating or I can be bringing another one. You know that I can also pay so that I'll be doing small, small business. My wife, he called me because of that. I was annoyed. My wife is still finished. Take the money and send to another Chinese person and give goods again. That person lost that money. Let him go and buy it. First. That person lost that money. I was telling her, give me money, give me money, give me money. You refuse to let her on. You tell me that you have sent money to one Chinese man. The person, you tell the person to bring you. That person did not bring the goods. You now give me the number of that person. Tell him to call the person. I tell him, if I call this person, who would I tell the person? I'll tell him, my wife sent me money to do this. Why am I here? I, I leave the money, leave everything to her. I don't know whether you collect the money again. You do not collect the money. So, from Wuhan, the goods that the one that he sent to China, and even in China, he had to send me money to do the for me to bring on that goods. He sent another person because another person from Israel sent the money to another person. So, since that time, the rent you know that I have lived here for more than 15 years. So, the people consider me because of the rent. I lived here uh, two years, they did not collect money from me because I'm like their son, like their distant. So, after they listen, they tell me to pay the money. I tell them, I tell them to give me two, two months for me to gather the money. After two months, I gather the money, I put it inside my wife's account to, to give me. My wife used the money. How much? Almost, almost 400,000 in, in Ghana. In Ghana. He used the money. The people now call me, where is the money? Now you are not in the I said, I've paid this money since one month. I call my wife, why you why never give this? You say you use it for business. Where is the money? Okay, bring it out of the business. Do that you do that this. I tell them to give me two years again. I cannot, I cannot get that money. I paid those people. Another one, sometimes like this. For me, if my school fees, say they are my son's school fees, if, if it's due, if I send the money to to to, to her to send to the school, she will eat it. On that case, I'll, I'll stop sending money. I will be sending money to the teacher directly. Sometimes 
If you stop doing that business, say this business is not for her again, you go to carry some from Ghana to Nigeria. So they find that an open business, I lose more than 15 million naira. The goods the people bring and my is more than 20 or 30 million naira. You leave all that in the sponsor, they lose 200,000, 100,000. They bring goods, they bring salt and sell. So from that place, I stop giving her money. After suffering, I come back 20 last year. November, like this time, I sent my wife because that time, this thing could enter my body, pneumonia. I come back, I stay for hospital for more than most. December 20, almost two weeks, three weeks, I come, I call my wife, say, if this is my, my children, if they finish school, let them come back to let me see them. I send her 150,000 to two of them to come back. All of them. He said, oh, 150 can know this. How much? He said, 250,000. I give her 280,000 for them to come back 23, 24 December so that I can see them. Because that time I never, I just came back, I never asked, I was working with my, my sister. I never get shop, never to get uh, the, 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 the place that I'm doing my business. My wife did not come. After December, January, my wife took that money. We went to Beria, February, March. My wife now come back to the village. A car is a car is a, car is a snow's brother. Come after they come, and now narrated all these stories. See how my wife takes part of my money. Look at this again. His brother was yeah. very, very annoyed in the night. They left, he said that they're going to come back again so that we sit down and talk again. In the morning, I have not seen my children since five years. In the morning, he beat the senior one. The way he beat that, I was sleeping upstairs. He beat that one. That one come and cry. I say, why? He say, mommy beat me. I don't know what to do. I say, bath, let us go out so that we sit down on this and talk. I want to sit down on this and drink. After my, this one, I cannot bath them. That, because that one is almost 12 years. You go and bath them, you know what? Two of them come out. You want to go out. You never go out. I, still, I, I will never bet you. I sit there too. I sit there inside the house. My wife come and pick one. Go out, say, I want to kidnap my children. I want to take them in the home. village. In the village, people gather. Say, where am I? If I want to kidnap, he's in this village. But you are meant to take my children. So, when last? When did you see the? Are you just seeing the children now? Yes, I, you know. After that time, I wanted to okay. And now that you said that I'm not going to go, I'm not going out with these children tomorrow or next week. I'm going back to Lagos so that I, I go and find shop and find the place that I'm going to live because I'm not going to live in Ghana because everything in Ghana I have rented the shop out. Everything have been messed up. So now I tell my wife, these children now, you know what me to go out with them. And now I'm not going to take this children out because I never get apartment where I can put them. These children, be in the village with these children, find any school of your choice, put this these children so that I'll be taking care of them. And you try to be in this village. If it's one million or one point five, I can give you so that you start small thing. Two of you, two of you with my children, you will start life again. If I finish in Lagos, get a place, I can come to Kupai. Yeah. My wife, my mother, and every people to her. He said, it's no good to stay in Lagos. I want to go back. Now what? I knew that. I traveled to, I traveled back to Face Lagos. Face me here. Letter. Face me here. Letter. Face me days. here. Letter some days. I called my wife. Where is my children now? Where are they going to school? He said one is living in. He said they live in Kete. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. okay. It's okay. Hello. It's okay. I want to ask. Did Did he actually give you money or not? All the money. You had what he said. Is there anyone he mentioned that he did not give to you? He didn't give me money. What of the business? The business. He was like I rented the shop. Three shops. I was at. His shops is the one that rented it. One of his shop, he rented it to Chisoba. Chisoba gave him the money. That was when he was planning to go to travel out of the country. Which one do you rent out on your and, own? Okay, the one I rented out is it's not that I didn't rent it out, just that what you use indirect to open my shop. The Buddha people in Ghana have blocked. So they were like, if you want to open your shop, you have to use a Ghanaian person. A Ghanaian person will be staying in your shop. So I used a Ghana person to open the shop, but I collected money for it. Is it not your husband's shop? I mean, uh, it's my husband's shop. So if you decided to put your goods in the shop that was already existing, will they drive you out? Yes, they said we shouldn't be. 
the other Nigerians should go out of the shop. They don't want to see us. Okay, before you rent the place out, did you inform him? I informed him. And he asked you to rent the shop out? He didn't tell me to rent the shop out. I was telling him, look at what is happening. That's out there. The, one of his friends, CK, wanted to take the place. CK was like, you're just trying to. Is CK us. not a Nigerian? It's not, he's a Ghanaian. A Ghanaian. Uh, okay, before you rent his shop, uh, did you inform him that you are renting his shop? Did he give you approval to rent his shop? I, he didn't give me any approval. He's no more minding me. He, didn't, okay. he doesn't talk to me again because they've told him that I'm wasting his money. Okay, the, the, the goods that he sent to you, did you really send the goods and account the money back? The goods he sent to me, some yes. of them is not branded goods. Of which I, I have to call most of his friends, they come and see it. The earpiece is not playing very well. Even the person that bought it. Oh, the earpiece. It's not all. But the person that bought them, I told him the day I'm selling it auction to the person that bought it, the person bought some and paid me some of the money. Okay, when you auctioned it, did you tell him? I told him. He asked you to auction them? Yes. So the person too did not even pay me all. The person was like, come and pack the goods, and the goods is not working. Even I have to give, when he, some of the goods that he brought, I give some to the junior brother. So when he saw finished, she will give me money. The junior brother, when I demanded the money from the junior brother, the junior brother said, I should come and take. He just bought the goods and said, take the goods, it's not working. You just pick the good one, please. Me, myself, I know it's not good, so I didn't touch the goods. Okay, what of the other money he gave to you? He didn't give me money. He collected loan from bank people, almost 90,000 Ghana cities, almost 7 million naira. Mm -hmm. He never told me that he collected the loan. He was telling me he collected like 2 million naira. And that 7 million naira he collected, he never used even one naira to buy goods and keep in the shop. It's that time I have not started coming to the shop. It was when he left and I started coming to the shop, then I see the Susu card. I saw how much that he collected and I asked him, how am I going to pay the money? So the goods that my brothers give me from Alaba, when I sell the goods, I'm using it to pay the woman. Later, the woman was like, I'm not paying the debts that my husband is owning. That she'll come and lock the place. And other banks too. About five banks that we are owning. Where do you want me to take the money from? And he was, they defrauded him. And the banks, you have to pay them their money. One of the banks have taken his car because we use the car as collateral. When we are not paying the money, he has to take the, the car. Then another one that just said, if you're not paying your debts, I'll come and lock the shop. So I have to call him. I tell him that call Agile. This is what she's saying. She said you are not paying that she's going to lock our shop. She he was like, What am I going to tell Agile? I said, just call him. At least you have been good to him before. I don't know whether he called or not. So the goods he was like, people are giving Which me money were you using to do your own business now? My own business now. And I'm not I don't have any money, but once I enter the market, people are giving me goods, then I will can supply. I'll give them their own. That is how you don't have any money. People are giving me this. If I go back now, I will go to the customers. They will give me this. Go back way. Ghana. Out of some of you women. Out of 20 million naira, you will not grab 500,000. Not 20 million naira. He didn't give me any 20. Even sometimes I will send you, when you send them, goods, give me receipts. He didn't give me any receipts. Well, what is good for some of us as a woman? your marriage is what you should be doing but when you are doing something as a woman don't do something that will dent the image of other women or anabra women or anything i can't imagine okay you say you're trading you all gonna ask you now you are still married you are with this diary and you must move on with your life you see because I you have moved listened to me this thing do you know what they call move on are you living in his house are you living in the, in the parents I'm house living in his house in general they are living in his house in Ghana. Yes. He's the man in Ghana. I don't know where he's, he's, he's where he's about. He never, he never comes so we talk. Okay, did they, this man ask you to stay with his parents? He did not. That is why I'm calling him. Come, let me know my So son. he has not asked you to stay with his parents, with the children, that is ready to give you money, at least you start first, so that people... He did not. I'm calling him. I'm the one that calling him. Come, let's talk. He will cut the call. Because they told him he shouldn't talk with me. Even why I'm trying to force him ways. The mother was like, why are you talking to him? The sisters called, they were like, you should leave the place. Okay, hold you on. Uh, long, uh, briefly, because I need to attend to that case. Okay. What, do, what do you want? Mama, why I talk, and one called the police you, to her village, for me to know where my, my children are. Leave that one, say, okay. what do you want now? What I, what I need is, my wife to tell me where my children are, because he's telling me to bring one, to bring one. I don't know where the money is going to. Are you done? Hold on. 
Are you done with the marriage? I'm done. You are done with the marriage. I'm done. Did you do ask for the for the diary from the family? Have they returned the diary? I will go for it. Professor, my mom and I have, I have decided that I will not go anymore because she's not truthful. She's not truthful at all. What if she decided to be truthful? This thing is not supposed to be here. You don't supposed to report it just to here. This is this truth supposed to? If, you know that. See this, this office. Has, Hold on. What this office can offer you? Even your parents cannot offer you. Okay, ma. I yes. know. I've been watching it from China. I mean, I don't know that the time I come and look at the picture, I look at see. You. I don't know. That. I say this kind of this office that brought it. I know that you solve many problems. Many problems is not one or two or thousands. This issue is since one, two years or three days. Me, I married my wife in Lagos and do everything. And they have everything, has a car and everything. Money is there. You don't expect my mother. I have more than six or seven sisters. No one is good. I have a brother who's no good. The people that he's doing friends, they're my enemies. The people before they do, the people want my downfall. As mean that my wife is a good wife, he could have gone and begged my mother. Look at what is happening. Or one of my sisters. How can I be married a wife? I'm not. I will not be satisfied with my family. Everything, because of my money. This woman have married before. He have one, one, one child. One girl. Five years, I marry her. I take the, the child to Ghana. Now it's 18 years, 13 years now. He was, he's going to school there and he's going to university. I'm the one telling her, I marry her. Being one of his, his uh, brother. What well, are you no shaking brother. head? You should be ashamed of yourself. One you of are his talking, brother. Not let and one of his what is your problem? Is, 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 are you not seeing what he's talking about? One of his you should be ashamed. And, and he's and talking, you are still shaking no, your head. No, you want no, you don't want no, him to talk. No family, that that's pretending that's you want your marriage while you are already in that suit. We are living together. No love for family is the truth. Now he's annoyed. He's insulting my mother. My mother for 80 years will go and cook for you. Why I have rice and everything at home. He said, My mother, you don't give me food. Am I not going to cook for you? Eh? Okay, now I want to see my my children. If they are demanding money, demanding money. How can I be paying money without seeing my children? It's okay. If you are living in Ghana, why is you living what, at the um, Ago? One of my child is living at um, um, Alaba. You go and live in Ghana. They were telling me to pay rent when you and your, your, that your daughter and what your face is living. Is it possible? It's not. Tom, uh, what is your name? Uche Navi. Yes. Anything that is worth doing, worth doing with. And whatever you cannot do it, don't try to do it at all. It's two things. I keep saying, you can't be single and be married. Either you are married or you are single. Or you are single, you are not married. It takes love. It takes the fear of God for a man to marry you and marry your daughter or marry your son. Applicable to other side and my stand funny and if i'm talking to you don't laugh otherwise i watched you do you hear me yes if i'm if i'm talking to you you want to do your face as if what i'm talking i'm just gisting you i'm going to watch you and i don't care i did not send you here you brought yourself here i can't imagine i don't know what you are denying and where did you take the children to? The children cannot be with you. Either you stay with the kids and you have no any legal rights to seize his children from him. Except you say they are not his kids. Then he conduct DNA tests between himself and his children. Thank you. Then if the kids are not for him, go with your children. If the kids are for him, you will give him his legal right, access to his children. I keep telling both men and women here, if this is not working between you and a man, don't seize his children. Don't deprive me in him having access to his kids. If it doesn't work out between you and the woman, don't seize her children. She gave birth to them, she not showed them, she carried them for nine months and she gave birth to them. So both of you have equal rights. You can't have children without the span of a man. So you can't put a child in Lagos 
another one is in another place then you 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 will be in ghana uh, uh, governizing and be catching your cruise there you can't find the, the man you don't know his whereabouts you don't know his whereabouts but you know this family the parent the mother is still alive and you have if you have moved on you can, can still keep moving on because you move on from one man before you met him you can still decide to keep moving on but don't don't see the children nobody is holding you not to move on with your life the one you have before that is 18 years you are almost a grandmother he's not his child and he's still taking care of her or she's not he's not taking care of her but he accepted you and the girl so you can't be in ghana they should be paying her straight for you in ghana as a married woman and your husband is in nigeria and you want to be there as a free woman and you are looking for the same man i call him again in china i called in that place one of my son is this day. have you ever seen where they do a case they say a man kidnap his children can they somebody can i can somebody say i steal this cup that belongs to me how is my if the property belongs to me so how would you say i kidnap it or i stole it for what belongs to me some of us should stop and you should take very we should take straight and take normal like a normal woman be how would you feel that you give birth to children and one man is somewhere frustrating your effort of having access to a children you know that you are you illegally own them or you biologically hold, hold them you don't do that you're asking you come to this place it should be paying the children's school fees it should be doing this and be feeding you feeding you where and, and to like, pay school fees of a child you don't know where you kept them or even if he's accusing of infidelity do you even know whether he trusts you that the children belong to him uh no i just only have fifty thousand to come back to this so if the fifty thousand is not common he said they send you two hundred and fifty thousand to bring children yes. he brought the children he said one fifty cannot be enough he sent you two hundred and fifty thousand two eighty you come to nigeria why are you depriving him of his children? I didn't deprive him of the children. I I'm the one, me and my children who have been looking for him. Mom, looking for him where? We, are. we don't know his address. Okay, fine. He, see him. When we call him, he will call them. But he doesn't want us to know his house in Lagos. This is sister that is talking about. I didn't do any. Mama, please let her talk. Brief, oh, brief, mm -hmm. because I need to attend the to other sisters you. that he's talking about, I've not even told anyone, idiots, I've not insulted anyone. But did, did they all, he was did like, mother is okay for you. Yeah. She doesn't yes. cook for me. No, she doesn't cook for me. So my husband will be yeah. like, I should not make this with the sisters. Because if sisters, he gives you that ground, then meaning he loves you. I go there. Me and my, my brother, well, excuse me now. Why you sent me? Wait. My brother has told the, uh, the wife, my, me and my brother wife, we went to the elder sister house two times. I kneel down and I beg her. I, I'm begging her so that I will be pissed two times. Before I not beg them in the village. Okay, I was like, if your sister said that I'm not a good child with them, what did I do them? Where have I offended them? Am I having any issues with them? It shows that they don't want me. If they say that I offended them, I don't want them to say what I did. Have I insulted anyone? Okay, but you know you cannot see the children away from me. Ma, please, I didn't see the children. I myself have been, I've been the one calling him. Even while he's in China, okay, where were you? I will where call are you him. Now? As you say, because but they cannot give you children, children on the streets now. Excuse me. But if they can't give you children on the streets. They should know where they choose. You are living as well. I'm living at uh, Agege here. Agege? Yeah. Are you living in someone or you are living I'm yourself? I'm living myself now. I sent her 50000 to come back to Ibe village to say, show me where the, 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 the children are. He the 50000 I sent the, uh, we reported the case here at the, this place, um, what that call it, the case in Atikeja here. They then tell me to send my wife money so that you go and bring the child. I sent another 50,000 last month, last two weeks to eat the money. Send 50,000 too small again to now to bring that child again. From Make where? From where he's going to school. They said I want to see the, the, the child. I hope you know that this office don't support him. Are oh. you aware? Are we aware Absolutely. that we stand for justice? I've been watching that. that okay. If you have been watching, do you know that we don't care if you are a complainant in this office that we only tell both of you the truth? Mm -hmm. Why are you doing that? I mean, no, he gave me the money. I told him that the money will not be enough. Where is the child schooling that 50,000 is not at least? Each person is with 5,500 naira. So I told him I will take the 5,500 naira and travel to East. Then while I'm coming back, I'm going to pay for two, two seats. Yeah, Where son. are the kids? 
when is he in his game or his school? Until now, you have not brought the child. He's in school. So uh, he didn't give me enough money. The people there told him to give me enough money. Pounds. He refused. I'll arrest you. 50,000, two pounds. He refused. I'll so arrest you and I'll make sure they, are, they, they, they accompany you yeah. to go and produce that child. For me. I'll arrest you. For me. For me. For me. For me. For me. They sacked the small one from school fees. And the small one called him. That they sacked him. He told them that they should sack him. So for that 50,000, Hello. I can't listen that, to both of you at the same time. What so is your from problem? From that 50,000 he gave me, I use it and settle my child's school fees. Because he was like, they should sack him. And when they sack him, they'll come and take him. So the 50,000 naira. But you are not in the east. How did you know? Enroll? But you just said that you enrolled the child in, in Lagos. Mm. So how did the child you enroll in Lagos? They call like this guy for me, they will detain her. You mm. will tell us where the Why? child is. The child is in school. In at school, where? yeah. Boarding school. We are we school. We school. Saint Augustine. Saint Augustine what? I've been giving them their number. They give me a number. Which number? I give them to so that I will bring them. I give them. Bring their phone number. Let do this for me. Let them bring their phone number. Don't have time for this nonsense. Can't keep somebody's child that be dragging up and down. What kind of people? Call the person. I want to know where you are staying with the child. Cannot be here without going to school. They are crying. So I have to register them in the school. No, because I don't know his where. Bring her phone. Like waiting for a man that is not seen. Bring her phone. He bring her phone. Not this phone. Bring her phone. Bring my phone. But him is service with their phone number. I'm not with their phone number. Which person's phone number? Yeah. Which 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 person's phone number? I'm not seizing. I just have to register my child in the school. My child cannot be. I'll be calling him. Let's register the children in the school. He will cut the call. You are not in Ghana. You are not in Nigeria. Today you say you are in China. Next morning you say you're in Ghana. To next another day you say I you are in Nigeria. So even you, you as a mother, how would you register the uh, children in school without you being with them? The children are still tender world not to be with the father or their mother. Yes, what kind of behavior is that? Call the number. Call the number now. Bring, please bring phone, phone for me. But my son, you know, I did not see him. I shouldn't register the child in the school. I don't know his well about all the money I've been sending. If you don't know, he had all the money was he had been sending to you. Which money? The money at the, you're asking me which money? He didn't send any money for me now. He didn't send any money. He's not giving us any The money is sent, and you say you use it to register the children. The school is bringing the children for, for, for him to see. I use it and pay for the children. Yeah, I'm, I'm sending him to complete the money. I don't know exactly. The, the, the goods that the he have been sending to you. Man, he did digits. not send any money. And I've told you the goods. So somebody sent, sent goods to you. Did not send money. money. It's not a. Mo it's not money. It's if you are a good business it, person, can they? How would you see a woman that they give ten thousand established and they expand the business? We are into five banks. We did manage to eat. If you know we how to manage, how come that you both yeah. of you did not? Is it one person is crashing, the we other person is taking it up? Even my elder brother, I do not bother. The ones he sent for him, that one is not good. Eh? Everything is not good. You but have started. I think he asked you to go to the villages. He gives you money. You refuse to go to the village. You want to stay in Ghana and stay in Lagos. Give me the number. Zero eight zero. Zero eight zero. Give me the number. Which person's number is this? Because there's nothing attached to it at school. Uh, that's the number. If you want to see the child, you can see the child. They would make a video. You see him. Who is the video. person? Is the headmaster's phone number. Headmaster's phone number. Mm -hmm. Call the person on video. I don't have this. I don't have this. Give you a hotspot. Bring it. I'll give you a hotspot. And at the end, you will still pay the money before you go. I cannot hotspot your phone free of charge now. It's not if uh, uh, where is it from? You, you don't know me, sir. <laughs> But there is something I still don't understand. This man, he left us. He never cared that the children would eat, that the children would go to school. 
and I went and registered my child in the school. Where have I wronged? Where have I done wrong? I didn't hear from him. I'll be calling him home. The villagers have been calling him home. Let's sit down and talk. He doesn't want to mind anybody. Eh? Is, have I done any wrong to go and register my child in the school? You did Where not do I anything wrong, wrong, but he did not have the right to be private. I don't know his whereabouts again. I don't know him. I don't know his whereabouts. When I called him, he would call the phone. Why do you refuse him access? I think I refused. I, sir, I said we are in the village and he leave us there and travel to. He said he's going to let us. I didn't. I didn't deprive him of that access. I'll be the one calling him if he will say the truth. I'll be the one calling him so the children will talk to him. Even check WhatsApp messages. I'll be the one sending messages to him. He doesn't send. He doesn't even care. Even while we're in the village, the villagers were like, since we don't know this, that we should educate the children and go and look for something that we do it before hunting the man that is children. frustrated. That yeah. you cry, you according to you said, the old five bank, you are calling him to come and pay children's school fees when death is on his head and is you don't even think of his where his head if he's dying. If, if I'm calling him, have man, killed he him, he's not open up to me he uh, because you are the man instead of you. Be concerned about his welfare. You are being concerned about children going to school. He must be alive. Is this year? Is this year? For all this way, has been in China. Mm -hmm. Do you know what it is for somebody to trust you with, with one naira? Then the man is there trusting you with money, saying thing. You are that is even when you are supposed to send you some fucking money. The money that he collected shows that he rented. He didn't send the money. I have to lock down my child in the police station in Canada. Because he's going. He cannot send hundred thousand. He collected money from the from a tenant and go to China. He never paid them. And when the money is due, they have to come and arrest me and my child. is locked in the police station. I know how I do. You're a crook. You know how to lie. So you didn't rent your shop to Chisoba? How many shops did you have? He rented the how shop. Shop, how many shop shop? Did he have? He have uh, three shops. What happened to the three shops? He rented one to Chisoba before yeah. he's traveling to Ghana. Yeah. Then the second one was at Seppo Mall. That yeah. Seppo Mall was container. They said we should, everybody in that container should, should go. That they're going to give the house. Did that one? I didn't rent it now. Uh, 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 are you not the one that rent it? No one. Chichenko and Eba they said everybody should go out on this. They push everybody. All the, because it's container shop. They said they want to build a, a block house there. That is why everybody leave the container. And that is when I now went to his own shop where he's staying. That container place is where I'm staying. I didn't rent it. I have more than four shops. I rented a shop. I directed this to give her money. I sold one of one of my piece of land and give her money to start the business. I, I, I make up money. I give her 500,000 naira. It's and a also lie. Make, and also How much did they give to you? He didn't give me any one naira. He rented it. He, he sold his land. I used the money for his child, uh, paper. I don't know. It's like they, I don't even know when they sold the land. All I know is that my husband has sold his land. He did not even give me first words. But uh, I sent to goods. The last goods I sent for you is 2.8 million. 2.8 million. And I also, you see it. And also, clear the goods with the son. That I'll bring the land. one selling him any time you give me goods. Give me receipts. Let me know which one is which one. Let me know how much you buy this one. Even the goods he brought, he sent to me, said, the goods for sure a lot of my customer. Because when they come, they buy. For sure a lot of your customer. Yes. When they come and buy the thing, it's more working. But Tomorrow, you go to the that third place. business I'm doing. I'm sending, yeah. I leave my wife, I send another person. Ah. That person, only one year I, I do the business with that person. I make more than 20 million in so they send it to you. Yeah. It doesn't work. work. If they send it to another person, which debt are you paying? But it's only a seven million naira. Only another person one million naira. Why are you choosing? One million naira. The okay, regime. the debt you are owing, who paid the debt? The regime. One point one million the debt? naira. Excuse me. The debt you owe, who paid them? Only one person owe money. Only Adia owe almost five million naira. Who one. paid? She's paying the one small million. Why Adia? I have do business with her for a long time, more than 10 years. They who paid the debt? They call me again, give me more than 5 million. I, I said, say, who paid the debt? She's no paying answer. the money for us. She, not, no, not she's paying the money. Have they cleared it? They have no clear the money. How much have they paid? 
Know. So you are the one, you are not accumulating debt for her to be paying for you, and you expect why she's selling paying debt for you. She will see use out of the debt money. See you. So if you meet another, you know that somebody is sleeping with her. What will you say? You say your wife is sleeping around that. Day. You take debt. Debt is on your head. You did not pay your debt. Then she's there paying your debt. You said you gave her money, and if you give her business, the same business or whatever, she's paying debt of five million. Even you that is sitting down yeah, can't even million. account how much she has paid, and you are still blaming her. You are still blaming her. Oh God, what no, are you talking about? No, the only money that she paid is only what two, two million naira. Did, did you carry her along where you collect money from? You collect goods from Asia. Was no, she no, part no. of the of your this thing? No, and what did she I sign know? a guarantor with you on that business? No. So why do you put the debt on her head? Since if, if she's in my shop, if she's selling the goods, she will pay her small, 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 small. Because the goods, if I'm like, oh, I just six million, and the goods inside there is more than. Pay the debt. Is it easy to pay debt? At, at, some of us should be and also be reasonable in our thinking. You leave them for somebody to be paying. Hello. I want you some video. I want to see that check. Okay. Hello. Hello. Good afternoon, sir. People air. People air. I'm on my twenty human rights. So I talk. I have. I talk. I make video with you. I have to cancel people. Go. Come again. Put Hello. that phone on speaker. I'm not here. Say, say what? Put it on speaker. Hello? Bring the phone. Sorry, sorry, sorry. For that. You say what? Let me tell him that I'm giving the phone to you. Hello, uh, can you know you sing the human rights for or watch your phone from you and all shape for cancer? People, go. Oh. 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 Where is the keys? That's what I'm saying. Did I understand what you are saying? Am I from here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I go do cancer. What is there from the post of it? Actually, you don't walk out there because the father was like, I'm eating a long run at school. Oh, okay. Okay. You put on a post and you don't walk out there. So you, the from you are the one that leave the debt. After the debt, where did you go to? Why are you not there to be paying your debt? To to make more money, to get more debt. So since you traveled, how much did you how much debt money you sent to her to pay? Why I'm bringing goods? If you, she sends the goods, they give it to pay the money. Hmm? If I send her goods, she can send the goods and give it to pay the money. Was that what you told her? She's, 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 is what she's doing now. Is what she's doing. So where has she wrong now? Where has she gone wrong? When she was she's pay, she has been paying the debt for you, and goods are there, and you had some of the things you brought, you are not good, and you also instructed her to sell it out to, to somebody, and you are aware that they bought it auction. So where has she wrong? I want to know. When my, they, they rented my shop to cut my knowledge. I don't know where he keep. Where I got my goods somewhere. Rainfall and spot all the goods. Goods of how many million? He's not telling me. I, I don't know where he keep the money. And the, you the you see, it affected everybody in the market. So I told him, he's aware. I will make a video and show him. Did she make video and show I make a video of everything. Video and oh, so why? Listen to me, Mr. Really? Really? See. I know at times we may mistake in our lifetime. But at times we should still be fair when we want to allege people. You understand me? You are the one that collected your bill of debt. It's not easy. I cannot imagine that somebody take a debt of one, uh, 10 million. Then you are sending me good this light to be selling and be paying the debt. And know that I have a contract to supply this light. I have the money in bulk and make the money. 
people is a retail shop right it's not a wholesale that people come to buy something in wholesale in bags go and pay and you know okay whatever fault you have in the goods take it and face it she retail to the public and they think they see that she cannot even make sense you are not she's not the only one selling other people are selling the same thing other people are importing other products and at the end you know that water spoils some of these things and there are some that are not functional and you are aware that you ask her to auction it so why are you casting every blame on her then they say her have your children she did not keep them isolated she still make effort to put the children in school at least your child is in school without you contributing or without you knowing whether they are feeding or whatever issues you are having with her at least she struggled to put the child in school what if the children are still maybe left like that with, in without any of them going to school how would you feel is that not a setback for you and your kids mama she's learned that the goods that i bought is no good all the goods is good it's what we can use against me because the same goods that i, I gave her i give this another person that gives me one okay why did you hold on why did not you tell her to give the goods to the person that is supplied that confirmed that the goods were good why didn't you ask her to return the goods to the person to help you sell it why do you allow her to auction it to another person because she was not the one that bought it and you said you approve it that you should sell it you should auction it to the person the person you gave the goods to that sold it well why did you instruct her instead of you auctioning it to the other person give it to mr maker that i bought i brought that sold it possibly you make how many million why did you ask her to return those goods to the man you know why this is like this because because there's presentation of all the goods was in the shop you go and bring the goods go and bring it up go and knock it on the ground you know if you leave the goods on the shop that goods will not spoil nothing will happen because we sell the goods and make a lot of money there. on the ground how now i make a lot of money now and you are owing debt is it easy to make a lot of money and you owe debt Yes, now the goods on the, was on the shop like this. I keep it on the shop. Why? Because of you want to rent the shop. You rented the shop out and bring the goods and keep it on back of the back of the house. Keep it on the floor. This is rent for and spoil all the back. You know that beautiful. Listen, Were you there? The, the, the video you can send to Who me. Who are the day? Who be the day? She video you can send to me. That they bring the goods out of the counter and keep it on the floor. Rent spoil on the that floor. very shop that she rented, is it the one you asked her to rent out? No, I don't know. It's the time if they send out to police, they call me that my wife is the police. I say, Why? He said, He rented the phone shop that is the most go to her. Eh? He's not inside the police station, they call me that they arrested arrest, they arrest my wife. I don't know. They, but they arrested that because of your debt. It's not my debt because we rented the shop and use it for another business. I don't know what it is. You don't tell me. Why did they arrest you, madam? Okay. It's not that I rented the shop. And it's Why did they arrest you? That is the question. Okay, they arrested me because the shop, I collected money from the shop and I was not able to pay the landlord. So the landlord was expressing that when I collect money from the person that I put there, because that is how everybody is doing. You, we Nigerians, we are asked from the shop, you have to put somebody. So I was like, since the person is inside that shop, using that shop, they will have to pay me. Then what made now a landlord to boss an alliance is that he was like, when I collected money from the person, I did not give him. He said that he can go and buy goods. And the goods. And your husband to... sent you money for the for the rent for that place. Mm -hmm. Which one did he say? Four hundred thousand. Four hundred thousand. For house rent. He didn't even send four hundred thousand. What we are paying is let me say one hundred and fifty thousand naira. Oga, how did you send four hundred thousand? I sent for two years. Two years money. Only for two years money. How did you send the money? Cities. 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 How did you send the money? I sent it to her account. To her account? Yes. No, the, those people that are doing transfer, so I have to send them what somebody's uh, account number, Nigeria account number. They did the he pay the rent? It's not 400. Did like, he pay the rent? He paid. The first one, did you use the money? Uh, I saw the landlord. Yes, yes or no? Yes, yes. The first one he said, did you use the money? Yes. Before you send the second one? No, it's the second one that I used. I use it and buy goods. I beg the landlord. So the old man first sent the first one. The first one I paid it. You paid it. Mm -hmm. He sent the second one. And the second one I beg the landlord and my husband that sent his money. But I use it and buy goods. As the Anambra woman. So that's when I said the goods, at least something that comes up on this, I will use. And his children I living with you there. Were yes. they living with you there? Yes. And children that you have kids under you. 
instead of you to pay house rent to where where sh uh, that shelter you and the kids you quickly as a fast woman that know business very well you choose to embarrass your children until they have to lock you and the children in the cell than to choose to do business with the money instead of paying rent where you are sheltering yourself you know where you are too desperate for something desperation is not even good it's if man can be desperate to try to stabilize you but women when you are too desperate in life it doesn't end well will you drop that phone yes you said you call me the phone they said they're waiting for me have they called you yes then you should have first said excuse me you can't pee for i can't be talking I'm to sorry. you you pee for started scrolling on your phone Call them. Uh, Mr. Mm. Raymond, have you changed? What do you say is your name? Okay, Chuku. If I if I'm to go into this case, one, you have your fault, and she also have her. That none of you is free of your comfort here. And when you become judgmental, when you are judging one side, then it's very wrong. If you pass every blame on her without you, sit then you will not sit down to think of which area this woman is good to me, then you are being unfair. There is nothing wrong. It's not every man that do business and bring their wife in. I know so many Igbo that their wife cry that their wife, their husband is doing business that they can't assess that shop. They can't go to their husband's office. You can drop it. They're not the one calling you. If they're the one chatting you, they would supposed to have picked the call. And if you if you bring her into your business and she crumble your business, one maybe she have no idea of the business. Or secondly, before because uh, uh, you give her too much hand to control the business while you are not around. Do you understand me? So you also that left debt on her head, you you should think of so many things. Either under pressure, you put her under pressure to find a way to to pay the debt because she wants to please you, and before you know, she begin to go into different looking for a relationship, a man that will give her money to pay the debt because she wants to please you or you allow her to want to pay debt that you put and business is not moving market is not selling and you are pressurizing her and she wants to have please you because she wants to remain in her marriage you push her doing something contrary to what she's not supposed to do so if it says she built house in the village and you want rumors anybody can scatter your home and move on with their own home. There's no home that is perfect. But if you allow anybody, your siblings or your brothers and sisters to destroy your own home, they are living in their own home peacefully and they may not tell you what they are passing through in their home. Yes, it's very proper for a man or a woman. If you are in marriage, let us think of how our spouse family should come close to us because that is even the enjoyment of the family. When you don't have my family and you are in the relationship, it's another error. But when they also conclude and they become the catastrophic in the marriage, then you have to give space. If you have an issue with your wife, uh, your wife is having an issue with your family, as a man of the house, try to resolve them. What they want, let them demand it. Then she can do it for them. It's only when they are demanding, maybe they are demanding for her life, then she will say no. But it is just an understanding, an apology. You did this to do that, and she withdraw from not doing it again, and she apologized. My dear brother, there's nothing in this world. You just have to let everybody err. To err is human, to forgive is divine. They should learn to forgive and move on. My mother is 80 something years. How long mama will stay in this earth and she'll be keeping my lips until God call her to glory? And she's leaving her children in this world and nobody know where you are going in this life you have sister-in-law daughter-in-law you want to torment her because you feel if she's married to your son don't worry time will, your children are also married to somebody if they did not do it to them now you don't know when they will do it to them because they are not dying today life is still moving on if your sister 
sees much F error in your your wife or the family see much error in the husband and they don't even think of what is the way out everything they complain about the man the man is this the man is that the woman is this the woman is that their own cup is waiting for them they will drink out of it when there is issue people should look into how they can resolve it peacefully there is no way you will stay your wife even if there is any issue both of you need to sit down and iron it first you are not a baby as a married man before you ask a woman hand in marriage you have already an adult and you should be able to take decision by yourself what you tell your parents is what they agree with you even if she she's sleeping around and you tell your family she's not sleeping around i've confirmed that she's not they will believe you if she's not sleeping around that you tend that how you put her into this train and be selling on the street your wife is sleeping around though your wife is sleeping around what you trade is what they see what you are selling is what people see to buy from you do you understand me Mama, yeah, what, what, all what you say is true but the person that you are telling is is bigger than me let me tell you the person that will give advice will never take advice you will do what she decides, whatever she likes, like, she will do. You know, this lady that you see here, tell me that he is in my house. Tell me that he's traveling to see her mother. From that place, they stop at Tonocha. Go see one of my friends. Stay there three days. I call her. I want to speak with your mother. You say he's one of my friends. Three days. Why? Did what? you go to uh, to on the chat to stay with one of his friends for three days? Why are you tell you are going to the village? That time is like no time. I want any time I ask you a question. You are too smart. You are smarter than yourself. Okay. Yes or no, Madam Tuno, an Abra woman. Did you do go to his friend and stay with him for three days? Why you tell him you are going to the village? Yes. Why? I did not tell him with the mother that I talked to. How? It's not that I went to the friend's house. The friend we met at the junction of that village so the friend was like they were them too they the were friend friends. was like my husband friend the friend too. was like he's he was for like, your age you are still talking you are still speaking street english the okay. friend was like okay the friend he's was coming like. from from his own place too so he's going back to Alicia with the wife so they saw me and my children at the at our village junction so he called me and said oh so no no i come to the village i never to you now went to the house, Abby. Uh, I joined them, so all of us went to their house. And stay for how long? We stayed for two days. Then. Two days. Mm -hmm. Are you not a disgrace? You are a complete disgrace. Well, it's just that I'm looking for helper. This see my picture here when I was no food. All of a sudden, I go you to go the to the place and, and you now went and stay with his own friend for two days. Not his ma. This person is living with a wife. They, they have a son. But do you know, hold on. When they ask you enter, did they tell you they don't have problem? This person is like a, a, a family friend. If you become a family friend to you more than him than have the friends. The person has been living with us before, where we are living in Lagos here. And for that reason, he has no right to be the one to ask you go there or don't go there. My husband is like, he overlooked us. He doesn't care about me and my children again. He doesn't talk, he doesn't care. So he doesn't even talk to me. So but you like, said you were going to the village. I told the mother that I'm going to my mother's house. Even the mother that you said that I should carry the children. How the did they get house. to know that you are staying with the friends? Uh, when I went there, the friend had to call, call him and ask him that the wife are here and I'm complaining bitterly. So what is happening? So he was like, you should send us, like you shouldn't accommodate us. You should send us out. So the wife said, what is happening? So it's like the wife of the friend called him too. Because him himself and the wife, they are five and six. So it was like that we come down. But do you know you can make a step that you are innocent of your movement and they can nail you to be bad because of the movement that you do? Are you aware? Yes, or no? I said any place Answer like me. I go. Okay, you now decided to go any place. You said that she can do prostitute to eat. That is what he told me. When I'm telling him that's and not you not me. decided to be doing the prostitute. No, I can't do prostitute. For seven years I'm on, I'm on my own. I can't do it. I don't like it. Where is the father of the, the other girl? He's in the village. He's in the village. 
please, ma. The, the headmaster said he will come in a few minutes. If you if you manage your home well, do you think this woman will go to your friend? If you manage them well, do you think she can go to your friend? Mother, because I, I know that you are a, you are a, you are a, you are a master degree in complaint. You are a complete complainant. If you manage your home well, will she take your children to your friend and go and stay for three days? Mom, I have what you take to take care of you. How? I have. I By running and hiding yourself, if this woman have access to you, will she be going to places to places and going to man or going to friend to go and keep or begin to narrate your problem? Mom, I'm not here. I was in China. Everything. That's what I'm saying now. It's my picture when we're in the village. Even the children, too, they have to eat from never place when they go out to camp. Here, once they Did you finish, hear her? They will give my children food. My Mom, children I have eat. rice, dear. I have everything. What is what? everything? Make sure that thing that is everything. I have carrot, I have a fufu, I have beans. Who bought them? I'm, I'm the one bought them. Every Christmas, I bought everything. Keep at home. So if you buy it every Christmas, it start, it end, it end in January, in the next Christmas. I've been sending my wife money. Every time I send her 50,000, 30,000. I see, the time, I see. The time, the time, the time was in, in, in Nigeria, he did the business. Then her daughter, the time was in Ghana. I've been sending that one, 40,000, 50,000, every two weeks, three weeks. Which of my daughter that you are sending money to? Talk you. about her and your children. Leave her daughter alone. I've been sending money to Because you see her daughter before you marry her. Yes, not be sent. Ma, please, let me talk to you. I did not ask you. How did you send the money? Which month now? Every two weeks or three weeks, I send the money to her. Where were you? 30,000. 30,000, 40,000 in a year. You have changed from 50,000. It depends how I get money. Because she's doing her own business. She's managing business. So this one because a woman money. is doing business now, you don't take no, your responsibility as a man again. Okay? You take, don't know your responsibility as a man. I take, I take the, my responsibility. Nobody, what is your responsibility? To take care of my child. Nobody is taking care of my child. Nobody is giving them food. And nobody is paying their housework. And the school fees. So, the and who, which of the school fees have you paid? There's no one that you have paid, unless only this one that you, I don't know where I don't know where they're about. Since we are was in Ghana, and they want school, and they want pay for their school fees for their fees. The question that I want to ask you now: Have you married now? Not yet. Not yet. I want three things that you want to tell me exactly. That is the problem of your wife. What are the three things? Just mission theory, no more than theory. Major one that is a problem. What is it? Number one is what? Number one, let me hear one. Let me hear what her. Is she deaf? If you tell her to do this one, you will decide on her own. No, we'll do what I will tell her to do. If nothing I will tell her to do, we will decide on her own. Like what? Give me one instance. For instance, like my family people that I'm not good with. If I tell her, no, go there. Is that place will do their best? Those people will do their best friend. Which one is the second one? The second one is your family people like your brothers and sisters are It's not my brothers and sisters, my my village people, yes, my village people and children. Mm. Those people the, the one that bring my dad for. And I'm I've been having problem with them. And my wife go and take them as their best friend. So how can I be married her to take my enemy as my best friend? The second one. The second one is, is to the lie. Like lie no master, like lie, all the whatever you're telling me here is lie. You don't take advice. This case, you see, no brother, don't call him long time. Please, this is you're going, you're going wrong way, you're going wrong way. This police people here have called you, you are going wrong way. Wrong. This thing, you're not supposed to, we're not supposed to settle this thing here. You're the young one, you're the young one. So now, the person you brought in your life, they can't hear you. As you, as she there here now, as she is here, if you give them two million naira. For you to collect the money two weeks time or one month, six months time, it comes to five hundred thousand naira. Okay, so she don't know how to manage finance at all. Number three. Number number three. Okay, give me number four. Which is the last one? The, the first one, she's very stubborn. She had not listen to you. And she uh, she associate with your enemy. Number two, she lie a lot. Number three, she don't know, she don't know how to manage finance. What is the number four? 
Number four, it's, it's too much insult to my family. Okay, she's disrespectful. She disrespects her family. Yes. Did your family respect her? Very, very well. The time was having problem. My money, my mom, my, my, my boss come, come to China and beg me to forgive my wife. My mommy need down and beg me to forgive my wife. I never forgive my wife, but my wife every time complain about my mother, every time complain about my sister. Every she's complaining that she's reporting them to you. Yes. You are not living with my mother for 13 years. I marry, I marry you. I have not lived with my mother for one week. What is the fault of your husband? If you have any. The fault of my husband is one. He listens to, let me say, gossip. I've been living with him for almost 10 years before they travel or seven years. Before number two, travel. number two. Okay. You know, he was mentioning the not talk statement. Okay. You know, it's the nature he of my talk. He doesn't have a word of his own. How? Like, if me and him talk finish, we will not conclude it. You have to tell the, some people. Hey, because you are not acting like a woman. You, you are acting to. You are acting like the head of the house. When you you don't want to take advice, you feel because you are adult, you are advanced, you, you have your life before both of you married. For that reason, no excuse for him, no advice for him, no opinion for him. Your duty is to just suggest. As a wife, you suggest in the house. You are not the one to say this is what you should do sir can we do this my advice is it good i i want to suggest can we do this that is how a woman behaves but when you are not suggesting you become the commander hey, i want to buy this phone one let's buy this phone there is a different bit can we buy this phone uh, for social reason because we need phone to uh, run the business in the office can we buy a land phone i want to suggest Women needs to suggest in there. You cannot say, let's buy phone. We need phone in that office. For that reason, let's buy phone and put phone. Mm -hmm. When you are doing it like that, you are creating fear in the heart of your husband. No matter, or even if you are little, you will see, see even if you are adult, you will see you as you are controlling the house. Mostly, if you become an adult, before you settle down, you have to work very well on your marriage. When you act one thing, the other will not see you. If you behave now, he will not see you as somebody that is stubborn. Because if he's married to 20 years, 18 years, 19 years, if the person behaves the way you behave, you will feel it as if the person, the girl is trying to be stubborn. If you act the same way the girl acts, he will say it, you are controlling. This is the two difference between answer them, let me do what I want to do. Let me see. This is not a video. Now this is a picture. Now. Oh, it's video. How are you? Take the camera to her. Uh, is that your son? Mm -hmm. That is phone. Now. Talk to him. Hello, can you? How are you? How are you? How is your school? How is everybody? It's a long time. Are you not missing me? Huh? Don't worry, at least you have seen. Very fine, but. Is it easy to hold a child? Like, haven't you seen where they give a child to, to, to somebody? Your wife will hold a child. If you, even if the first day you set eyes on your children, you will cry. Did this child look like a child that is being, that is not taking proper care of? They're eating my money. It's my money they're eating. Uh, how much do you send every week? There's no sending. I, I start to talk a bit like with our mother. So eh? they're eating my money. So the other things. Oh, you said so what? My everything is my money they're eating. Eh? You don't talk like a man. I thought you would talk like a responsible man. No, you said the woman. You say it's your money. You say you have not seen. You say the woman used money to build house. House we did not find. You say you use money to do what? They she no. did and pay your debt. Your children are going to school. Cut that thing. You say they are eating your money. 
and you have not seen where they give woman money she lavish even use the money spent on her boyfriend and her children will be suffering you have not seen you have not seen where you give a woman money she finishes and take your children and go and dump with her parents in the village the school your child is are you not seeing that is a standard school or you think she don't see any other local school to put the children in it do you think it's every woman that have feelings of your children is it not a mother that abandoned the child of two weeks and after we find that brought her to lagos to come and see her child after eight years she came and she said she just come to see the child and the next thing she disappeared and leave the child again you left your child two weeks you born the child and leave the child then after seven years you find you've not seen the child for once it's two more two weeks that you born the child then the child turned seven years you can't even recognize the child then they brought the child to you were expecting you to cry and hold the child i want to go with my child okay what do we do with the child and i say i just come and see him i come to see the child and go so can you give them please so do you know what what in a bad life human being we should learn how to appreciate people when they do good things we shouldn't even claim rights you've not tried tell somebody god god that created us and heaven and earth if he did not like appreciation he will never say if the human being he created did not praise him he will cause stones the tree to praise him that means he want appreciation if he did not want appreciation he cannot say he hears so many people and he's only one that return back to say god healed me of leprosy that means we are nature of God and we should do like him. Women can be worse. I'm just blaming her because I have to blame her so that she can sit up. I will blame you because I need to blame you so that this thing can be amended. I can't close my eyes to your error and close my eye to an error. And that is why I say both of you, nobody is free, free of you to reunite with your family these children need you they need your advice they need fatherly touch they need fatherly advice and the same way they need you they need their mother and we because you say this woman lied too much uh, she don't know how to manage money and the other thing she associates with my with my enemy all this is a minor thing that can be traceable can be handled if you always, you as a man, if you sit where, I am married to a man. And I know where he, he positioned me. And I know how I can talk as harsh as I am on social media. They know bought me where to be harsh in my family, in my home. They are not trying. I can't be harsh to my husband because that is my home. That is well I should there are certain things I will not tolerate. Before I react, I have to think well. This person I want to talk to is my husband. How am I doing that? I try to do it also with his, with his own head and principle, policy as a man. If he leaves me to do as I like, yeah, I know one say, okay, this is how, no, let's do it this way. He will emphasize, we have to do it this way. You emphasize this is the right thing to do it so everything you want to take blame your mother complain your sister complain everybody complain we all have complaints we are married to my sister in laws complain about me my brother in law complain about me my brothers complain about my husband my sister complain about it but at the end of the day we are the most consigned then we'll not say okay let us bring our extended family home but let's see how we will manage them but if you want to, because of everybody that complain about your wife, you don't need home again. You will marry again, sir. And another one again will start, they will still complain about the person. They manage your home so that there will be amendments. Auntie, just like I said, I say, you either be in marriage or you be outside. You can only be married and you can't be single. And the talk crazy from a woman in the matrimonial home cannot work out. If you marry 100, it's only a that, it's only a man. Uh, even some men, if you are feeding themselves, you can't even try nonsense with them. They will still sit you down as a wife. When you are doing things and begin to equalize and begin to raise your dad and begin to merge with your husband, both of you begin to, to, to measure up, such marriage cannot work. If you are looking for your husband for you people to settle, 
there is a way you go about it. Argument, you will drop it. Defense, you will drop it. No, 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 no. I did not do this one. I have to defend it. No, you don't argue when there is tension. You will accept, accept what you did not do. You talk too much. I am sorry, sir. I will change. This person I say you should not associate with it. I promise I will never associate again. That is how to make amendments. If you give excuse, hey, he rejected me. It's those people I run to. Hey, he abandoned me. It's even when a man knows that a man will want to pet you and treat you like a woman when he know that you are humble, he has break your shoulder. Don't go and listen to social media advice. Do you hear me? Some can tell you, I don't take that nonsense from any man. They are taking more than what you are taking. They are taking more than what you are taking. Why will you ask? Why will a man ask you to sit one place and you see that? Are you okay for your age? Yes. He's the head of the house. Sit where he asks you to sit, madam. And you will see it. You will enjoy peace more than anybody. A man did not really need your money. The ones that need your money are the psychophants, are the gold diggers, are the gigolos, the hustlers. A man need respect from you, caring, sincerity, truthfulness. If you have those things, he can go extra mile for you. But if you are giving money, you are lying. You are giving money, you are cheating. You are giving money, you are disrespectful. He will not see your money, he will see those characters you are displaying. Do you understand me? What is here is not enough to scatter your home. But if you don't use wisdom as a woman, of, and there's a man of the house. The house will be separated. Children, see, you have beautiful. I think I, I the child, one of the child I, I was admiring that day. Were well, you not the one that saw your son? You're not the one. But you brought one child today. Is that your one of your child? These children need both of you. But if you don't use wisdom, you allow the devil to scatter. You will not be there to, to let the children know how to grow up as a father. She will not be there for the to nurture her children as a mother. But you don't consider all this. You are just being selfish about how to please your family, forgetting that your children are there, that they need you more than your family. God forbid anything happen to you. She can't give the children to your family. The children will always stay with her. God forbid anything happen to her. They can't give the children to her family. The children will be with you. So family are secondary. Both of you are the first and the kids. And that is why you have to make it a priority. So you begin to count error, 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 error. Everybody has error, sir. If you can't tell us too much, you will never see good thing about your wife. If you check errors too much about your husband, you will never see anything good about him. We keep errors aside. We we'll look at one good thing that the person do to you. Station your mind towards that. And that is the only way you can excel in your relationship, in your marriage. Because everybody is in this world to end. When are the children going to be on holiday? You don't talk Ghanaian. I second. I second. No, speak like that. It's true. It's the Ghanaians are the best English speakers. By second of December. Second of December. And you said you are going back where? You are going where? Do you say you are traveling? I'm traveling. Okay. Do you know what? You are living in Lagos. It's your address that is you later. Good. If you had what I would advise you, they are not going to pull the child from school. Do you get me? It's going to affect his lesson. Can you go and visit your child in school? That is the love of a father. Don't ask them to risk the boy bringing him to Lagos. Then she, you, they know that he can give address where the boy is. Both of you can go there. You can go there. Go to the school. 
pay a visit to your son. You have not seen him for some time. Get some provisions. Go there, sit with him, just with him. I'm waiting for you, okay? When you are done with your school, mommy will bring you. Then they can spend Christmas together. Do you understand me? And before then, issue some plan with our colleagues. If it's required, if any of your siblings are they in Lagos, whatever is their error, we can book a date. They will come. we we'll resolve it. Do you get me? And my dear sister, what does not belong to you? Vanity upon vanity is what is vanity. Anything that you feel is in your possession that you have not spent, finished, that is still with you, this is your husband. Your money is for your husband. Your husband's money is for you. Don't hide anything from him. Sir, I am sorry. I've made mistakes in the past. All the debts have been paid. This is what I've been able to realize. Trust is very difficult to build. But if you are purchasing somebody trusted, especially your partner trusts you, don't betray it because you can't buy it back. You can't buy trust from markets. It's an expensive task. So you will check that. And don't say because Anambra people know they carry last. No. Anambra women doesn't carry last. No. I am the head of the house, so I have done. He has suffered me. No. Bring peace. Each time you drop peace, oh, God always gives room for that peace. When you drop peace sincerely, God will at, at touch that mind for peace to reign. But if you begin to pretend you have a motive, you are planning to harm the man, or you are planning to harm the woman, and you are pretending to be good, no. God doesn't permit such thing. So you go on the secret, assess your conscience, assess your mind. Look at it that he has trusted you before, and that trust for whatsoever, anybody that advise you anything, you need your home, you need your marriage, you need your husband, you need your children, both all of you should be together as one family. You need your sister-in-law, at least you see somebody that you can play with and all that. Yes, please, can we have a meeting? And that meeting, open up to him. I'm not telling you to tell him, because I'm not going to leave it to Open up to him, whatever. I did not say, say it now. That's why I say, go back and rethink. If you still need the marriage, go back to him. If it's one other that is left, it's one couple that is left, it's nothing that is left, create that avenue, both of you should meet. Open everything to him and promise to withdraw from your way of lying. What a complaint. When you lie, it can affect your marriage as well. And just like I said, I said, don't argue when somebody, when the tension is ready. I know you want to talk. You are still ready to argue. My husband said it's difficult to teach an old dog a new trick. If you are too old as a man or as a woman, and you don't bring your ego, it will be difficult for you to amend or to blend with people because you want to always say, why would die? Why should I? That is pride. That is stupid ego. But if you drop your pride and ego and drop arguments, and accept error, even when you are not at fault. But settle the matter first before you make amendment to allegation and all that. It will make a way for you. I don't want any of you to give me a headache today. I'm, I've talked too much. I don't want to talk again. No, but That's why I'm going to start. I hear you. But how are we going to see, see the children? Now, this one that is in Lagos now. And you will give them your address. That one is what the government requires. You cannot say you are going to be on the streets to pick a child from here or pick a child from there. Give your address, she will come and drop the child. At least you should know where the child is staying. And we should know that you are you have the house there. Do you get me? Then when she needs the child, when your both of you agreed on dates to pick, she drop on Friday, pick on Sunday because the child goes to school. Fine. What about the other one in the school? What did I say now? Did I speak Latin? I thought I speak simple English. Okay, I hear you. But you know, this woman has given me a headache a lot. I don't think that I will continue to do it. So you say he give me arguments. There's nothing you tell her that she, she will never argue. 
I will hear what I said now. I yes hear, or no? Yes, I hear what you say. Have I said have I talked to both of you before? Yeah. Eh, before? Mm. Have I talked to you and, and this woman before? No. If I've not talked to you and this woman before, then you will give her a room and know whether there will be a change or not. There is nobody that including you that is sitting that you are not perfect. Are you right? I'm not right, but I don't are you perfect? Second chance again, but you is this second chance in Kiru. Okay. As a stand, we are not going to force you against that. But the only thing, take the responsibility of your children. They have access, they have rights to have access to his children. Do you understand me? Very, very well. I'll do that. He said he's taking care of the children already. That's what he said. So, what do you not report it again? I was like that the abandoned process has not been paying the children's fees, has not been paying the people's fees. You heard what she said. That you'll be paying the school fees and you'll be paying the children's school fees and also the upkeep from now. Yes, that is why I reported the case. And that, uh, the Did case. you hear it now? Don't tell me where you report again. Yes, they were before their head. So, how are, we, are you going to be paying now? I will, I will have access to where they're going to school. If they're going to school. For any time the school fees is due, I will pay for it through where by that time. You know, I will have access to you. Are having account. access already? That's what we are talking now. I'll pay through the bank you know? through which bank her own bank or the children have bank where they're going to school. They are, or they are feeding fee. I will pay through the business. I have their uh, feeding fee. You pay through where I have their uh, no, uh, what's up, uh, number. Uh, number. Our telephone number. Mm -hmm. Has he ever been doing that? No, he has not been doing it. If you have been doing that, how did he report? How did she report to you? Here? I'm the one reported the case. She's not the one report. In this case. place? No. I'm the, I reported the case. If you are doing it, why did she come to report to you here? You know what? When we treat issue of child of a children of okay, people, listen, for the next three months, we pay that money through the human rights account first. Subsequent one, once you know it's stable, then you can be paying it for. Do you understand me? Do you get me? Oh, yeah. Yes. So this one you'll be paying the school fees, the upkeep will be paid through the office first for three months. Subsequent on once there is no issue, you are paying it constantly, then we cannot ask you, okay, pay to her or pay to the the school authority from there. Then meanwhile, this child, where is the child staying? We are staying we are living in my sister's place. Where? In Lagos, yeah. In Lagos here. Is he schooling there? The uh, how much is the school fees there? Forty thousand by ten. They're in first term now. You say you want to have access to your children, and you know that they have paid. The one she paid, and you go and refund it to us first. That is number one. The one in that school is how much? I spent like seven hundred thousand naira, but then I paid two hundred forty-five thousand. Because you know, it's for a start. I paid almost six hundred eighty. So let me say six hundred eighty thousand. So let me say seven hundred thousand every ten. No, for a start. Uh -huh. As I registered in there, I said I gave them seven hundred seven hundred thousand naira every day. So tell me, I'm to pay two hundred forty-five thousand. Two hundred forty-five thousand. Will, will you afford to be paying 245000 every day? That is what I will go and verify if it's okay for me. I'll be paying if it's not okay, I'll transfer you from that. that no, way. you want to me here. There's nothing like verify. Can you afford paying 275000 You can't transfer the child to anywhere. You said you have the money, it's your money that they are eating. Oh God, this is the time you need to act no. like the man you claim. Yes, yes. mama, I want to ask. You have all the I millions know? in the earth now. How? They are telling you how that you are told two hundred. How, how will I know that they are paying that two hundred forty? It's we. It's we that will do the investigation. They can send the this to the The child is not the only one in that school. If I want to go and enroll my child in the school, the school will tell me how much I will pay. So it's not even about you. If you go there to go and investigate, you not even get the truth. A neutral person that want to enroll his child into that school will get a full package of. How to enroll child into school. So if she lied at the end, she will still be blamed and put to shame. No problem. My child, I will pay. If that is okay. The, if if but I you see the, the school now, you do not, yeah. you see the school premises, you it look was, your child. Yeah. I will pay. But can I call the headmaster? So you send the, 
the registration form. For no, them. you only give us the full details of the school. If we that know where we send somebody there, after we do the investigation, we inform you. As simple as that. The uh, what is it called? Two seventy what? Two hundred and forty-five thousand. Tell me. Two forty-five. Mm, for return. I use 700,000 to do this time. All the things I got for you. 245. That is 285,000. Mr. Chin, you are. Mr. Okechuku. Okechuku. How do we sort this one out? I'm looking for the school fees. And this is one of uh, is it already have already paid? You have paid already. You are the one that paid this one. I'm not the one. So why would you not say it's it something that you have already paid? How do you pay it? They are closing school now. This is a school, it's not for it's not for one week time, the school will go. Who says so? Who says so? They will they will finish the exam then, but I will ask them when they will vacate from the school. That is not vacation. Vacation for Christmas? Mm -hmm. I will ask. As I'm telling you now, you either cooperate for a peaceful resolution. If you bring stubbornness here, at the end of the day, you see you that will still start stressing yourself. Here is not police station. I will only talk to you for a peaceful resolution. But if you don't buy it, I only close the case. You we'll start afresh. Okay, okay. You see, you are telling me the children they are closing in one week. Is it not somebody that paid the, the pews? They are if we are checking, it's almost one million or eight hundred and something. Then we are talking of two hundred and eighty-five thousand. You still want to argue it again? Can we forge ahead? I need to attend to other people. I hear you now, but to. I thought that is it's not necessary, it's not major what they will start on that professionally. This one she paid no problem. She is uh, she's not the is in his song. All this was all this world, how many okay. days Keep the children days? and be taking care of the children. Leave the children alone. Maybe you can go and adopt other children since you are not ready to complete. Your, your wife is stubborn. Your wife is doing this. Wife is doing that. You don't parade the story. Finish now. At the end of the day, pay two hundred and eighty-seven thousand. After she paid almost one million, you want to add this in all his children? Then leave the children for her. Let man that want to help you train your children train. She's sleeping around, but you not take off your responsibility. You are not taking any responsibility because you heard what she said. You can't carry debt and give somebody, they pay your debt here, yeah, you go to China, stay there, they are calling you, are uh, uh, running haters, scatter like a rattlesnake. You come back, you want to see child. What if, the, God forbid, the children die, since you did not you did not care whether they are existing? You will come back and ask her, where is your child? Some of you should be reasonable. You are not claiming, is it not her child? And you are looking for the child. If not that the child is a minor, I would have showed the child to the camera. Let the whole world see the child, how she tra she take care of the child that you are dragging her left and right. Call police to come and do what? Give her refund to 85,000 now you, are, you want to see that. Excuse me. If you call any police for you, come and meet us in this office. Maybe we'll end the court. As you say, you have enough money. What nonsense is that? You have money, so you are calling million, 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 million. Two hundred and something thousand is not up to how many euro or dollars. You are pushing it on her. You want to carry your responsibility, drop on her. But you are looking for child. She will bring the children to you. You want to see the children, but you are not ready to pay your piece. But I give up. One week. I go and sit down. I give up hundred thousand. Hundred thousand. Do you know how many? To, do you know how much is a bag of rice? Do you know how much children eat? You hide yourself in the corner that you don't even know whether children are existing. You are coming here to say that 
you are uh, you give her a million you give her a million you are not even talking of you you left the bill that she was paying you left the one of your error you are talking your sister do this your mother say that yeah hey, this and that you lie a lot now you be truth madam madam mr innocent If you respond to the office, you let us know. Then you bring his children to this place. I just be claim a year right to you. I don't even know who gave you right that you are claiming. Take care of your children. You don't take care of your children. They are carrying police disturbing her up and down. You don't even know how they are feeling. You don't know how the children survive. You don't know the shelter. Are you not supposed to rent out for your children? You're asking that they should bring your children to go and give your 80 years old mother. Or they should take the children and give your sisters. Because they don't have their own children. Somebody who will have their children, born the children, they'll give them to you to give your sisters. They should also bring their children and give to her. Why are you claiming? You take the children for her to go and give who? You are taking the children for her to go and give who? Is she not the mother of the children? She's the mother of the children, but no one to take the children. I want to have access to the children. You want to have access? Do your responsibility. You have access to the I'm children. Doing. What are you doing? What are you doing? Do you know where this woman is living? Do you know how the children are being shattered? You are doing what? What are you doing? I'll start praying for you. When you did read it, I've said it. You say it's January, I'll be no problem. When school is, you bring the money here. We will pay to the school. You bring the children here by January. I don't go advise myself. Normal, simple, this is they drag rubbish to me. I don't, I don't understand. Which account can we have? Is it student account or which account? Take the account. See the account there. They have children in this time. They have a children account. They pay children, all these children you are seeing there, they are on scholarship, Abby. You see them on uniform. Those children are scholarship. Some of them, their parents abandoned. We said to this case, because we don't want issue between them, they pay to their account to go to school, collect the salary. Within the period we study that you are paying, we know that you are consistent. So we allow you to be paying to school. Please call about the ones that paid. Now, this one you are telling me that you have to refund me some of the money. Some of it refund Because I say you should go and refund. Did he send you to go and put the children in school? He told you that you are in with his millions. None of you should drag me left and right. If the if the boy come to to Lagos before we vacate, let us know. Before we will vacate for the year, they let us know. Give him undertaking to sign to be taking care of the children children and take their school case from the next time. As soon as they are done. They will say you are a conima. And thank God say you have been following us. Go today and go and read your comments. Open the church and see only church. Because the money that you collected from the show. Madam, the question I want to ask you, did this man use you as a collateral? Eh? Did he carry you and go and drop in that place? I say, I'm borrowing money. I use my wife as a collateral. Take her. Any day I did not pay the money, go and carry her and sell. Was there anything like that? Did you go there and fill any form as a guarantor for her, for him? So what is the problem? Why must you pay his debt? Managing the shops, so they will feel like they will come and lock the shop if I'm not paying the debt. Uh -huh. 
he said he, he said he gave you goods. He said he, he gave you goods worth how many million? Either you give him his goods to sell and pay his debts, or you leave the you pay the debts as both of you agreed. Okay, the person he sent the goods to. Ask whether the person is paying any debt because he was like he sent him goods to another person. That's what I'm saying. If you want the debt to go, you say the goods are not good, give him his good. Then you know that you are not paying his debt. All right, thank you, viewers. We'll be back in a moment.